I mean, let's just keep it real. You're a slut. Oh, I just have really big, you know, the ones that you want and you... How are individuals? I hope you enjoy my new shirt. Uh, this was given to me by Gary. And it was a spiritual experience, I believe. He, he was uh, browsing the store. And uh, he came across the avocados. And uh, once again, this is another dead brand of something that I was working on that was summarily destroyed for false accusations of child abuse, etc., 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 etc. How are individuals? I want you to know today that you can absolutely succeed in your life. There's nothing to hold you back from success other than your own laziness and non-motivation to get something done because in the ma in the last uh, in the mass three months in the past three months I haven't known what I was going to do to survive you know and now my hair looks like this maybe kind of like a fuzzy avocado or even a kiwi I need to talk to you about serious things. But what's funny is the Lord is making it be kind of an, in, a, in a comedic fashion, kind of with a different kind of character. It's not the Reverend Dude. It's Let's call it Jason Avocados is coming back at you. And he's gone through some really weird shit, including 13 days in prison, which was quite an interesting interlude of normality and and you know there's nothing normal about it it's just uh, uh, it's it's <laughs> all right uh let's see hi youtube uh this is jason william ebroff uh that is formerly revelation news on the the platform of youtube uh you're just looking at the the art for uh, Paranoid, uh, the, the Black Sabbath album, Paranoid, uh, and I am telling you that I want nothing to do with anybody that, that does YouTube. I don't want anything to do with anybody that's in a chat room on YouTube. Uh, I, I, I literally have nothing to do with this shit anymore, and I especially want G-Man to hear this. G-Man, I do not talk to anyone on YouTube or from YouTube, so if people are telling you that I'm telling them things, you're wrong. Okay, I hate this platform. I hate everything having to do with it. Sayonara, suckers. Have you got anything to say to them, sir? Yeah. Tell them we said sayonara. I know it's been a while, but um, I've been going through a lot, and um, I I turned on I shouldn't have, and um, saw a G-Man video, and it had my face on it, and it was a picture of um, of my face imposed on someone punching someone, and it turned out to be someone called Burnt Toast. I don't really know who this person is. I know they make videos about me, but um, I just want to go and apologize to Burnt Toast and, and tell Burnt Toast that I never agreed to that picture um certain violent tendencies i've gotten because of and um i find it very insulting that he would put me in such a violent
towards someone that I don't even know. Um, especially when, you know, most of the time I'm preaching and talking about peace and not going after people. And it just, it really, it really disturbed me. And it, like, it makes me wonder if he sees me that way. Like, I, I hit people, I hurt people. Uh, and um, I, I just, I don't condone it at all and I'm so sorry burnt toast of any misconceptions you got toward me or anything like that um I told G-Man I don't want him to speak about me anymore or talk for me because really he he doesn't really know me if he's posting pictures like that um I'm a pacifist a practicing pacifist I know there were pro times in my life where I failed at being a pacifist, but ultimately I am, and I want to be in a state of constant conflict, conflict with people, condone it, um, and, and him trying to bring me into the middle of a fight that I, I don't have the strength to even do, or I don't even want to do. There's no will to fight burnt toast at all, and there never will be a will. Huh? I'm gonna go get us some.